The heart is a muscle that contracts in rhythmic sequence for the duration of our lifetime. Each beat is stimulated by an electrical signal that is generated by the heart's conduction system. A normal heart beats 60 to 100 times per minute. Sometimes a problem with the conduction system causes the heart to beat too fast, too slow, or to have an erratic or irregular beat. A test called an electrocardiogram can measure and record the heart's electrical activity. In a normal heartbeat, the heart signal follows a specific pathway through the heart. The signal begins in the sinoatrial node or node located in the right atrium. The node triggers the atria to contract, pushing blood into the ventricles. The electrical signal then travels through the atrioventricular node or AV node and into the ventricles. This signal now causes atrial fibrillation, which is a type of rhythm, an abnormal heartbeat that is caused by erratic electrical signals originating from the atria. During this rhythm disturbance, the normal coordinated contractions between the atria and ventricles become compromised, interfering with the heart's ability to efficiently deliver blood to the body. In people who experience atrial fibrillation, many rapid electrical impulses originating from different areas of the heart are sent to the atria. These impulses cause a very fast and chaotic rhythm. Because of this rhythm, the contractions of the atria become erratic. As a result, the irregular contractions of the atria do not properly fill the ventricles with blood, causing the ventricular contraction to also become erratic. The heart rate may increase to 100 to 175 beats per minute or more. Atrial fibrillation can cause fainting and other complications. The condition can be treated with medication or with surgery. In some patients, a pacemaker may be inserted in order to regulate heart rhythm. In this video series, we are going to learn about atrial fibrillation or AF in detail. In the next video, we will discuss about its etiology, types and diagnostic approach along with pathomechanism of AF and treatment options including artificial cardiac pacemaker and all. Thank you for watching and do not forget to subscribe and support us.